everyone, welcome back to my channel. I've been thinking a lot about these emoji scenes and I wanted to create my own and I've been contemplating how I'm going to put the pieces together. What do I want my room to look like? And I've decided on what I want. So what I want is something that's basically set up like my regular classroom. I want them to have quick access to a calculator. I teach math. Um, Some place to check in for their attendance in case we're doing remote learning or distance learning. And then someplace where they can go and know exactly where to find all their assignments. So let's come over here. I'm gonna log in to Google. I'm gonna open up a slide, Google slide, and I'm gonna start adding the elements. So I found this really nice file cabinet and each one of them is for the day of the week. And then inside each drawer, they actually open and there's file folders inside and you can have all your assignments inside. I'm going to go ahead and title this. It's a geometry class. I'm going to say welcome geometry. Change the font color. And then I'm going to put some directions under here because this is going to be the first time my students will be using this resource for their distance learning. So notice there's also these calculators on top of the file cabinet. I have that same exact caddy, so it's perfect. My students will know what they are, and when they click on that, it will take them directly to calculator. So I'm going to continue to add all the elements to my Bitmoji scene, my classroom. I need a desk with a computer on it because that's where I'm gonna have them click on the computer and link them to my Google form, which is my attendance kind of check-in. And this Google scene, I'm going to actually use whether I'm remote or distance uh, learning and teaching, or if we're in the class, I'm still gonna use the same slide, same template. So there you have it. I'm going to link this to Google Classroom and they're going to go to the same spot and it's going to look basically the same. I just want them to be familiar with my classroom. It's an online classroom. So it's no different than my routines that I would have set up in my regular class. And this is how I'm going to do it. The only thing I might change is I might change out the file cabinet. I'm thinking about possibly using just a calendar instead. Let's try that out. So I found this really great calendar and I'm going to go ahead and link that and hang it on the wall of my classroom and get rid of the file cabinets. Taking a screenshot, I'm going to make it into a picture, hang it on my wall, and I'm going to link this picture to the actual calendar, which is, you can see on the left side, it's on the next slide. Then when they click on it, it's going to take them to the calendar. And on this calendar is where I'm going to link all of their assignments. So now I've done two different scenes. I'm not sure which one I'm going to use. I'm actually kind of leaning towards the calendar. It's just real simple, real basic. And I got to figure out a way to put my calculators out there. And that yellow container, even though my calculators don't look like that, I have a yellow container just like that. Caddies for all my calculators. So the students will know exactly what it is. Um, what do you think? What are your thoughts? Let me know. Which one should I use? I'm a high school teacher and I'm trying to figure out the simplest way to implement this. And I kind of want it to be used every single day so that they get used to a nice pattern. Don't forget, step out, be uniquely wonderful you. Bye.